Hi everyone, today I would like to do a approval. So, without further ado, the app that I want to start with is the MX player. First, to get the MX player is to go into the Play Store. Type in MX space player I should come up right there and explain so this review that I want to do on MX player you're going to need two stuff you're going to need the MX player so you download the MX player let us search for MX player Space code dick a r m oh here it is a r m v six that's the one you're going to type in here it is right here which I already have it installed you're going to install this. After you install those two apps, you're going to open up MX Player. So now, yeah, one thing that, well, there's a lot of stuff that I, I like about MX Player. There's not just only one thing. The only thing that I really don't like with MX Player is that I can't, like, shrink it down and then, you know, shift it one side on the screen and then shift it to the other side yeah but otherwise and that is it's a very good media player to play video content especially like 3gp videos because you know that not all the android phones support 3gp videos so yeah so okay we'll press okay turn that all right yeah it also display even new videos that you have also download to your phone so now yeah this is like the basic way of playing video on your phone these are only one thing that I like with it it has a lot of swipe just as I can like swipe across the phone from left to right and right now I want to set you to scan through the video baby. and on the right hand side I can like swipe up and down on the right hand side, volume up, volume down, and on the left hand side, you can swipe up or down to control the um, brightness. Now, what I want you guys to do now is you can either pause the video or, yeah, I'm gonna pause it and come out. Is go back to the front part of MX Player, click on that right there, settings. Now you're going to go into player and you're going to you know, rearrange. You know that these are the screen settings, you can set the brightness and so forth. The orientation now of it, you can put it on auto rotating landscape. And right here full screen you have it on auto switch already and you can put like you know the time meaning that how far you have reached in the video and so forth you can put the battery and the clock up there to show you know your battery because some of the time you may be on the road watching a video and you, instead of tapping the screen to like show your you know your battery percentage yeah it will just show at the top of the video okay right here yeah battery clock time uh, okay you don't really have to go through all of that right there right here it's the touch control or the gestures right these are basically it 
and you know, can zoom basically like pinch to zoom you, know, you can tap that right there if you want but it's already there by default so you don't really need to adjust anything in here you don't have to and uh, let me see Ah, right here background playback you know some of the time you you might want to like be on the road instead of having your phone out and like you know watching video me while you're walking on the road some of the time you don't want to do that you just want to hear just the audio alone and so forth you can just click that right there background play and that basically allow you to um, play videos in the background while your phone is off the phone screen is off yeah so can go back from here I think yeah and this also allows you to put like the MX player in your lock screen yeah so when you turn on the screen you know you can press like forward fast forward or skip song or whatever right here no yeah screen lock yeah right there basically show you a different style of lock you can choose like lock style one or whatever anyways done right there the decoder no here is where it gets interesting if you have ever noticed when I'm playing the video the percentage that it stops at okay I'm gonna play the video back again okay oh and you can also you know start over or resume by pressing here use by default so anytime you click on any video it's going to start where you want it to start or if you if you click um start over yeah and set by default yeah it's going to start all over any video that you click on if you click on um, start by default and then you click resume that means anywhere that you left off from the previous song or so forth yeah that's where it's going to start back okay so I think the auto rotate is supposed to be working. No? Can't believe it. Uh, display settings. Can't believe it. Auto rotate. Okay, hold on. okay, auto rotation. Here we go. So yeah you don't have to like be stuck in one view okay let me see can, can go, go, straight, go straight up to 15 percent so i'm going to start the video right now come back Monk. settings going to decoder we're going to click use H slash double plus decoder right there and you can also set it up you can you either choose to use this anytime you're streaming a video so basically it's on this right now this one when you're streaming a video right this one is locally because here we go check locally you understand so basically only when you're playing videos that's on your phone are that it's on your SD card or so forth locally right and if you click on this that means it's going to use the HW plus decoder when you're streaming I don't think you would want to do that on this kind of phone like the Huawei Y330 because the ROM is kind of crappy I have to admit but it's a pretty good phone still but anyways because if you choose this it would like 
pray to like a certain amount and then it start to stick 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 yeah so I won't click on anything else just click on that right there use HW plus decoder yeah and you'll be good with the audio let's now see how far the audio go there you go go straight up to 30 percent okay and yeah like how we have set that up um, I'm going to show you that there you go you can come out and yeah and still playing you basically come out of it and you just slide it down like that and here it is up top playing in the background and you can pause it or jump song or close it yeah that's a cool way to set up your MX player Thanks for watching.